okay in the previous class we are explained about the concept of this gas law and here in this class we are going to see the proof for this gas law so we told in the previous class that total electric flux is equal to the means total electric flux through any closed surface that we are considering the imaginary surface is equal to 1 by x naught times the total charge enclosed by the surface that we are indicated with pi is equal to q by x naught and burden. So we have to prove that one. For that, I considering the sphere of the radius r. Observe carefully. That is what we the sphere na consider. So this is a sphere and the radius r. Okay. So this is in the radius r. Now the charge enclosed by the sphere is q. What are the charges enclosed by the sphere is what q. So for that now I consider the electric flux through this sphere. For that I want to consider this electric flux. For that I given just I consider the small area. Small surface area. See this is a, a small surface area. So that is indicated with the delta S. Yes. That indicates the what small surface area and the electric field from this charge is in also in this direction only. From this, uh, this is a whatever the charge you are taken is a positive charge enclosed by the uh, sphere. That is the electric field is also in this direction. Okay. Now we can say that the flux through an area element delta S. Ignore both. Yeah, the flux. So that is delta pi. Delta pi is a electric flux through a small area. So this is the area we are taken in this how much electric field lines is passed through this that we are taken as the water. With the area that we are taken as the electric flux, small area. Now total concern money. That is delta indicates a small area. Is equal to E into delta S. Yes. Electric field lines through that area into the what area limit. So is equal to electric field is how much? Q by 4 pi x naught q by 4 pi x naught into 1 by r square into r cap so 1 by r square into r cap means it is in this direction only along the position of the radius radio vector that we have taken as a r cap okay now into what is there delta s is there okay into delta s that we call as the equation 1 other than now equation 1 the third so r cap n indicates the unit vector it shows the direction okay and here the same whatever the radius vector we are taken from this center to the area element that we are indicated as the r and here 1 by r square that is the distance square we know that since the normal to the sphere whatever the this vector we are taking it is normal to the sphere only you can take anywhere it is always normal to the sphere only it is along the radius vector so that okay so at every point is along the radius vector at that point the area element delta s and r are the same direction see this whatever the radius vector we have taken and this area element delta s are in the same direction okay so that delta pi is equal to q by 4 pi x naught r square into what we can write delta yes we can write okay because these are in the same direction so dot product of that we can take it as a what one so remaining is what delta s only therefore q by 4 pi x naught 1 by r square into delta s yes. okay so this radius vector and area element are in the same direction so if you can take this uh, r cap into the water suppose this n cap area element vector is you are taken as the n cap means r cap into r cap dot n cap is equal to 1 that is okay so that you are taken as the q by 4 for x naught by r square into delta s and the third degree. okay and then now equation 2 and the correct okay now we make a small area element and the third degree. but we require the total what area element we have total flux total area for that the total flux through the sphere the total flux through 
the sphere so the sphere is obtained is obtained by adding up flux adding up flux through all the different area limit all the different area elements that is pi is equal to summation of all the d's into q by 4 pi x naught r square into d's ok now we get total electric flux width so total electric flux enclosed by the surface if you want to consider the imagine why you can consider here this is the imagine surface all through this whatever the total electric flux pass through this is equal to the water in that case you have to consider the total area element total area element in a consider model because so that's why i have taken sum of all the ds okay so q by 4 5 x naught into r square into the area element ds okay since each area element of the sphere is at the same distance l of city and i prithyendu sita if you can consider any year 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 anywhere all are at the water equal distance from the r or we can see the total whatever the is area element you have taken it is having the distance of what r okay now we can write since each area element each area element of the sphere of the sphere is at the same distance is at the same distance R from the charge R from the charge ok equal distance therefore now we can write the flux total flux is equal to q by 4 pi x naught r square into sum of all ds into what ds ok so is equal to q by 4 pi x naught r square into total surface area of the water sphere that is yes total surface area of the sphere we required total surface area in the tone yes and total alone add more than yes yes that is the total surface area or total area of the sphere now yes indicates the total area of the sphere total area of the sphere so what is the total area of the sphere that is 4 pi r square so that is the total area of the sphere now substitute it therefore pi the total flux is equal to q by 4 pi x naught r square into s s yes is the total area of the sphere that is 4 pi r square now 4 pi 4 pi r square r square gets cancelled what is the remaining that is pi is equal to q by what is the remaining here x naught so that is the total flux enclosed by the charge q and the sphere is equal to the water q by x naught it is nothing, nothing but what proof of the gas law so that is we know that that total active flux through any closed image surface is equal to 1 by x naught times the charge enclosed by the surface so it's a proof of the gas law